Hey everyone, it's Rebecca. So we had our active sale on May 18th and it's just been go, go, go ever since. So this is really the first chance I've had to sit down and do a little video. But everything's been going really well. Super excited. A lot of work ahead of us. That's all we've really been doing for the last two weeks. Um, so, you know, we had to get our road straight. We got about a quarter mile road that needed some gravel. Um, but before all of that, like as soon as we had the sale, we had all the D'Angelo's come up that could make it. So that was super amazing. Everyone pitched in, helped with the beautiful garden back here. All the beds needed to be cleaned up and weeded and everybody pitched in. All the kids, they put their little rubber boots on and got out there and garden gloves. And it was so awesome. It was the most beautiful thing. And then even though we're a little 800 square foot cabin, oops, um, all the kids had hammocks and they slept up in the loft in their hammock. I mean, it was just pretty cool. Some of them slept in air mattresses. So it was pretty amazing to have the whole family here. Um, just, you know, having a weekend and really just enjoying one another and feeling this beautiful piece of property that we got and connection with mother nature and just, getting back to some basic roots, you know, um, with everything that's going on in the world right now. Um, but our goal here is to be able to have everybody who wants to be here, everybody in our family who wants to be here. It's plenty of room for everybody. Um, we want to grow and develop this land and be self-sufficient, grow our own vegetables, hopefully have some animals down the road. Um, and just enjoy life and like not take anything for granted and you know just get out of that flipping cookie cutter neighborhood and keeping up with the Joneses kind of lifestyle man it was like you know I've been working a couple years since I got out of grad school and it's just been a daily grind. I love my job. I love what I do. It's very rewarding, but just, just for me, getting back to nature um, is going to have a good balance in my life. And I think that's what we all need. We all need a little bit of, a little bit of nature, a little bit, of, you know, we all need to be outside doing stuff, exercising, you know, and just not, I don't know. You know, it's like, what's the point of, you know, I got a better car than this person, or I dropped 40 grand on this car. You know, I got this house and, and these freaking windows and this, you know, countertop, I got the marble kind of like, is that really all what's important, people? Come on, ma'am. Anyway, it's gonna be a big adventure for us, moving from a 2,300 square foot house in a cookie cutter neighborhood to 800 square foot cabin in the 47 acres right outside a wildlife management area. Yeah, it's going to be an adventure. So, I'm excited. I'm ready for it. And I can't wait to see what the future holds in store for us. So, lots more to come. We'll record some projects and how things are coming along. Because everything here is pretty, it's pretty raw. I mean, we've got a roof over our heads. we got running water kitchen, toilet, and then we got this beautiful garden that's already been laid out um, that just needs a little TLC, so 
start there and then clean up these woods hopefully timber some of our wood to build stuff i definitely want to take up woodworking like i want a miter saw i think it's called a miter saw um where i can just cut kind of straight lines angle lines to build like tables and bookshelves and you know just simple things like that um because you know we got we got the resources here on the property you know let us spend all that hard-earned cash and just instead work with your hands and make something with what god gave us so that's my take and that's my first vlog um, next time maybe I'll have a margarita instead of sake. So we, uh, we're going to build a table. We need a little table. And we're going to build one, and honestly, we're not sure if this is going to work or not. <laughs> <laughs> I did say I was a chef, right? <laughs> <laughs> and so I, fa I figure if you cut it, you know, like a carrot. Julianne it. Julianne. <laughs> then, you know, we could, uh, we could create this farmhouse <laughs> table. All those things are culinary to me, right? Yeah. This will be a good, like, practice run. We're going to do, like, a rough version. We're just going to, right? Yes. Do, like, a, like a trestle farmhouse table yeah, with the wood that's already here. Kind of like that, you know? Yeah. So, so this will be, like, the rough draft. Right. <laughs> we may use a chainsaw to cut the wood, so. Yeah. I just ain't got that miter saw yet. Yeah, not yet, but we'll get it. We'll, we'll figure, uh... You know, let's earn something and then we'll, then we'll, yeah. we'll get it. Pick up some wood and see what we got. All right, so yeah, we got some wood down there.
Thank you.